Okay, so I'm going to go over how to um, use Ferenti Tank, Bag Tools, and uh, Gear Foundry to auto loot, auto salvage, combine the salvage, and then and then and then organize your your packs accordingly. So what um, what I have right now is here's here's a Ferenti Tank right now. Pretty much I have enabled looting, um, auto stacking on. I don't even have this. I don't even have this on right now as a plugin. It does or as a macro, um, and so so pretty much that's all you all you need on that uh, part. Oh well, except for um, enable looting. So this is going to be the classic uh, the loot classics uh, snob uh, version one, and I'll actually bring that in real quick. So go over here. And so I have. I mean, it's pretty much. Uh, I chopped a lot of it out, but at the very bottom we have slayers, all the slayers that are in here, um, what slayer weapons I want, uh, critical hit weapons, and then um, this is where all the salvage would be, but we're not letting, we're not going to let uh, Verendi tank uh, loot the salvage. We want we want the salvage to be combined, and there's an error with uh, Verendi tank that doesn't actually combine the salvage. So put all, all the things that you want to be uh, looting for, in like weapons, armor, whatever it is, in here in the Verendi tank, but um, turn off all your salvage. You're not you're not looking to pull salvage from here. So that's on that. Um, so that's on that part. We got that done. Um, what we want to do next is we have Mag Tools. Mag Tools has, and I'm looking for it real quick. That's not it actually. It is this one. There we go. So Mag Tools. With mag tools, you want to have um, <clears throat> auto loot chests, auto loot corpses, auto loot salvage, and so those are those are the key components right there, because those will help um, loot for Verendi tank without being um, without being on macro. Um, so, and you also want to have you know show unidentified. You know, anytime you click on something, so let's just click on something real quick. You're able to see. You're able to see what what the 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 item is or what uh, loot filter it falls into. So hopefully that, that helps on that. Like that's a Tusker Slayer. Um, cool. So that's so that's that. Also, just to give you an update, um, this came from Driss, but um, j just for future reference, you can do a periodic c command in how many minutes. So I put it for five minutes to auto pack, and so it's ar it's already auto packed my thing, but. Um, when I didn't want to. So, anyways, like the salvage should actually, be, it, it's this is it's actually supposed to be in this pack. But anyways, um, so so that's that with the the mag tools, and then in the gear gear foundry, this is something people don't understand. Um, you have you have um, what is it? That's not inventory tracking. Move that out. You have uh. Uh, gear uh, by section, and so this will actually show you what corpses are here. Um, I, I typically use this if I manually. I'll, if a corpse dies, I'll actually they'll actually have these uh, corpse things, and you can click on them to open each loot to figure out which one is still. If you haven't opened the corpse loot yet, um, so that's vers uh, by section. Um, gear inspector is um, it is this guy right here. And this will actually show you anything that hasn't been processed or hasn't been picked up, and then what hasn't been processed yet in your in your tab. So so that's a really good one as well. But to set up, typically when you set up, it goes into inspector. You want to go over to salvage, and then you can enable all what you want in salvage in game. So I pretty much have all the the commons of what everybody has in salvage. But you have to remember what you're looking for. So like uh, Aquamarine, I'm looking for um, any salvage between one to a thousand. And why we do a thousand is because if you ever look at some of the bags, um, let's see, I'm trying to find one real quick. If it has it. Oh, there goes the auto loot. That was uh, or the auto pack. So that was uh, Mag Tools auto packing every five minutes. Um, so if you ever look at some of this, like here's a, a Iron Salvage 175. So it's a workmanship 175 so we have to have you know x between you know from from whatever you want to pick up to whatever the maximum is so you want to make sure you have 
the maximum of that. I haven't really trusted it with uh, Verendi tank yet, but that's uh, the workaround of how things can actually be put together combined wise. So like with uh, with granite, I only want to pick up something that's seven or more, and so and then it'll combine those together. Um, and then um, what you want to do is you want to have um, in the foundry you want to have auto loot containers and then auto salvage looted items and auto combined salvage bags so that is what's going to um, combine all the loot together um, on top of that what we want to do is we want to go over to character we always want to make sure we have uh, multiple salvage uh, materials and then I always like to make sure I have uh, use main pack as default picking up of items so it's always coming into this main pack it's just in case you're like looking over here and it's being put into this pack you want to make sure it's going in here because then it you'll be able to do it so all that is um is combining the salvage but we still haven't talked about how mag tools um auto loots you know auto packs so we go back over to here because we actually can use the Verdini tank looter so if i go into open go into c drive uh, no, it's documents. Decal. Da, 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 da. Mag tools. And so these are my these are my different characters. Um, so Brave Sir Robin, which is this guy, because each one's going to have a different kind of setup. So, and you can see that each one of these have a different loot setup. And so they're actually put. And how how I can explain this is, um, I have it kind of organized. But um, you have you have your uh, rule name. You have where you want to keep it, and then this uses the bag number. So one would actually be this bag, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. So there's seven bags all together. But let's just say you wanted to have salvage, and it's in two, so it's going to be, it's going to be in here. You can see that. Um, what happens if it overfills? Well, you can have two and three. And so what it will do is actually fill up number two, and then at the very, if, if it gets too full, then it'll actually push it to number three. So you can do these cool things you know, like four, five, six, seven. So you just kind of want to push it all into there. And so that's how you can um, get things organized in your, in, your, um, in your character. And then you can also, at the end of it, like I said, you can have mag tools run a command saying me slash auto pack every five minutes and it will always uh it will always put it back to where you need it to be so it's like you know when i get uh like my tapers my tapers go into the very back so if i press control p that's my command for for um just quickly doing it you can see that it's all back in here it's you know here's the tapers here's that so that's it i mean it's it's really simple if you have any questions or you have any problems with uh with setting this up so you can have the auto loot, um, auto combine. What happens is, um, and I haven't, I'm not gonna go kill anything because it's gonna take too long to do it, but you'll kill something, it'll auto, it'll auto salvage it uh, right when you kill or right when you loot, and then it'll place those bags back into these uh, containers. So this is completely free. So if, if you wanna use this as your cell window or whatever you wanna do, you can see that I, I don't actually have, um, I don't have uh, any loot filters for for peas or or sturdy iron keys, so they just they just sit in here all the time. But it makes it easier for me to figure out what I need to give off my character. So, anyways, hopefully that helps. Let me know if you uh, have any problems. Um, Discord, you know, or on comments below because it's going to be on a YouTube. So, thanks guys. See you.